What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. It's your girl Simone, and in today's video, I wanted to come to y'all and show y'all a four-week or one-month review slash update on this hair from a company called Long Yow Hair off Amazon. If you're interested on how to get this hair and the details about it, y'all stay tuned. Okay, so some of the specs on this hair. I purchased this hair on April 13th, 2019, and it came on April 17th, 2019. I purchased a 20, a 22, a 24 inch bundle with an 18 inch frontal. The frontal is a medium brown color with Swiss lace. Um, it's a 13 by four and 130% density. Okay, so now I kind of just want to talk about how I feel about the hair. Um, so as far as the frontal goes, I did actually customize, um, I made the unit I customized it, plucked it, all of that good stuff. Um, the hair, when I first bought it, it, was actually really, really pretty. It had a nice natural luster to it. As you can see here, it still had that um, natural luster. It's like the hair is not super, super, super straight, um, which I actually, you know, can appreciate because it looks a little bit more natural. Um, when I first bought the hair, I did actually go and go to the pool in the hair. So I feel like once I did that, it, the hair kind of changed a bit um, and it got a little bit more dry. So I decided to go ahead and deep condition it. And um, I washed and deep conditioned this hair probably once every like two weeks, depending on whether I felt like it was moving or it had nice movement to it or whether it was like too oily or I had too much product in it. I wouldn't suggest putting too much product in this hair or going to the pool with it. On, the, on Amazon's website, they suggest that you don't bleach or dye the hair. And I think that's just because um, this hair isn't you know top top quality where it can withstand those type of chemicals so if you're looking for something that you can bleach or dye i wouldn't probably suggest getting this hair I, like i said i never i didn't try it but that's because they suggest that you don't do so so i didn't i was gonna dye this hair jet black but i decided not to it had a nice natural brown like red tint color to it in the light but anyway, so pros and cons. Cons, tangling, shedding. Um, the ends are thin to me, in my opinion. Um, the pros would be, of course, that it's you know inexpensive. It's good if you want to just do something quick, something cheap. Um, I like the natural luster of it. I like the actual look of the hair. I, I really do like this hair, you guys. It's just that it... The quality is just not top quality and you can't expect to get top quality you get what you pay for at the end of the day so the frontal was good as well it was easy to plug easy to manage um, that one side where the hair is covering I just didn't want to lay it down that day so overall like I said I would purchase this hair again none of the cons are that deep enough for me to not purchase the hair again especially for the price of it but maybe if I purchased it again, I would just get shorter lengths so it would look thicker and the shedding and the tangling wouldn't be so bad. But yeah, you guys, um, I hope I'm not leaving anything out. But yeah, so long gal hair, three bundles and a frontal, $141. I would purchase it again. If you guys have any other questions about the hair that I forgot to mention, y'all please go ahead and let me know in the comment section below. And I'm going to just let this ride out. I'll see y'all in my next video. Love y'all. Bye.